this video is basically just junk I've bought from Primark and Sheen over the past like two days. Actually, to be fair with you, it's not junk, it's actually for summer and like a holiday. So I'm telling myself that it was worth the money. It was definitely worth the money. It was fun. Anyway, so as you can tell, I've got a massive bag of Primark in front of me. So I'm going to start with Primark. If the title hasn't already explained it, I'm going to be doing a Primark and Sheen haul. So I'm going to start with the Primark bag, considering it's literally taken up 90% of the room that I have right now. So yeah, I'll not blab and we'll just jump straight into the video. So I feel like I should start with this. This is like one of the most impossible things to actually get your hands on in a decent colour at the minute. And I did manage to actually find what is hopefully my size, because I I have no idea because I've actually never bought one of these before. It is actually like a really pretty colour. I'll turn, wow, that was up. I'll turn the brightness down so you can just see how pretty is that colour. Imagine this on holiday with a tan. Yes, please. This was five pounds for any of you that don't know, but I'm guessing that you do know. So yeah, got this. Whilst we're talking about sets, might as well just show you the next little underwear set that I picked up. How cute is this? I actually love the colour of it so much. I'll turn the brightness down again so you can see that like purple lilac colour. I had to have this when I seen it, like I just had to. This was again five pounds, which is like nice and it's wired as well, which love a good underwire, I'm not lying. I'm gonna be honest with you, I did rip the tag off this in the shop to get my bottoms like my size and then the top my size because the bottoms don't regulate right to the size I swear. Anyway, sorry if you work in Primark. I am one of the annoying people that did do that, but it was for a good cause because now I've got the right top and bottom. So, and then I felt like obviously those are cute or whatever, but you literally get like one wear out of it being a matching set, and then you have to like put the underwear in the wash. So, if you're like me, I like wearing my bras like longer with it. They don't need to go in the wash, do they? Like after every use. So, I picked up this set as well that just had the same color bottoms as both the sets that I just bought, and it has like this one. Are you can't see because of how bright it is in here has these ones at the front i think these are awful honestly i won't be wearing them in front of alex but i literally picked them up for these two so that makes sense because now i get like more than one wear of, out of a matching set do you know what i mean so to be honest with you i might go pick some more of these up if there ever is any in my size again i can't even remember what else i picked up honestly i did get like a few tiny stupid bits like i got this shower cap sometimes if i just want to shower and i don't need to wash my hair till the day after it will be ruined if i don't use a shower cap and I didn't have one so I got one. I picked up a pair of white socks right but it's sad because I love my like funky coloured socks like I actually can't live without a pair of like neon yellow socks and I don't know why and obviously they don't go with any outfits so I had to obviously stop wearing them because of that reason but I seen these right and I looked everywhere for my size. Bearing in mind I've been in Primark like four times and I've never been able to find my size in like these socks for some reason. These are the socks by the way I'm literally just hiding them from you. Can you even see? I've literally just turned the brightness down. Why is it so bright? Let me try and fix that. Is that better? I feel like we should have just started like that to be fair with you. Yeah and I literally was looking everywhere for these in my size and they were just non-existent. I was really upset and then I got to the tail and there was one pair of like really 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 bashed in ones at the tail in my size so I obviously picked them up. Just get a bunch of colours. You get like pink, yellow, green, purple and blue. Happy with these and I'm literally gonna wear these today. I know I am. These are gonna be my new favourite socks like I just know. And then some more little like travel bits I picked up. These are literally a quid. How good is that for a quid? Like you literally get all of these little different cleared bottles to like put like cleanser, moisturiser, shampoo, conditioner in. So if I need any more I'm definitely going to Primark to pick up more of these for pounds. Exfoliating gloves because I will not shower without exfoliating gloves. I can't. My skin like sheds 10 times faster than the actual normal person's skin. Yeah so I need exfoliating gloves or it's just not good. It's just not a good situation. So yeah got some of these. I feel like sorry this is actually so annoying that being there. Since when has Primark hopped on to the cotton underwear trend? They must be seeing it all online and obviously they have to step up the game and they have come out with like cotton underwear i've not been in primark for the longest time so actually excuse me if they've been out for like the past year so yeah they did like a pack of three and i was so lucky to find my size like i will stand there and look for half an hour through every single pair of underwear to find my size and i always do find my size and there's only ever one so yeah persistence is key guys so if you ever want some just look at every single pair and you'll find some but yeah i just thought they were really nice some gray white and black ones right so the next thing that i got there's a little story behind this but i'll literally make it two seconds. I was looking for beach towels because I'm going to a beach so I need some beach towels and I actually just couldn't decide because there wasn't any that I like really loved. Do you know what I mean? So I ended up actually walking 
a way. And like, I checked the price of one, I think. I checked the price of this green one and it was four pounds. And so I was looking to try and find one that I actually liked, like liked, liked, and then like, I just couldn't. So I just walked away. And at the end when I was going to the till, someone had dumped one back and it was like the one that I would have bought out of them like all. So I just picked it up and went to the till with it. I went back like two days later or something to get Alex a beach towel because Alex needs one as well. I'll show you the beach towel that I got him first. So this was the beach towel that I checked the first time around when I checked the price of it. It said four pounds. And when I went back to buy Alex the beach towel, I wasn't going to get him this. I was going to get him the matching one of mine because they did a white and blue one. Tell me why I decided to check the price. I don't know why I decided to check the price this time. Check the price, nine pounds. This beach towel cost me nine pounds. I was fuming when I said that. I thought there was no way I bought beach towel nine pounds but like when this one's four and i wouldn't mind but when i went back to get this one for alex there was a nicer shade of this it was like a white and like a nudie peach and i was just even more fuming because at least if i was gonna spend nine pound on a beach towel i could at least get the one that i liked but no so yeah fuming that it cost me nine pound and then like i showed you i bought alex this one last thing that i actually picked up from primark oh no two two things the last two things were i just got this skirt it was the last one in my size as well and it's just like one of them long pencil skirts are they called pencil skirts just for work and then to go with that i just got some 10 denier tights i really wanted 20 but nowhere seems to do 20 little interval i ordered something from the 70 percent off misguided website you know what i mean and i got this hoodie for winter which it looks like white on camera but it's ecru it's like a white cream and i really like it and i also got a coat as well but that's literally just for work as well so yes that is everything that i got from primark and then on to sheen because i've got so many bikinis from sheen i actually did send like a lot of my order back but had to keep literally 90% of the bikinis so I'm going to show you guys and you're actually going to be so proud of me because they're all so colourful I didn't buy one black bikini right so the first bikini that I picked up is a pink one comes with the little normal bra cups which I like these because you can tie them around your neck all different ways the bottoms just look like this they are the ones that tie on the side and they are like a semi thong I like that as well and then it also comes with like a little skirt how cute is this you know like a little beach skirt so you can like tie it wrap it around i just think how cute is that that's well nice so it's a little girly for me like i do feel like a little princess in it but maybe it'd be a vibe then i got this one as well i really like the ones that have this little charm on it do you know what love islands got me into like liking the ones with the charms on it and like the gold detailing because i would have just picked a bunch of normal ones if i hadn't have watched this year's love island yeah i got this bikini as well these are the bottoms and they also have the like little charm on them this ones are like a little bit more of a thong in the front but like again are the same in the back again sticking to my gold detail one i got this bra they're actually all tied upside down because it looks a lot more flattering when you tie them this way instead of like the normal way just like a nice little plain basic white one and then these are the bottoms i didn't want anything too dramatic because can you imagine if i go and i'm just like the one that is obviously like tried really hard do you know what i mean like i don't think i could deal with that and then the next one that i got is this because i actually do have a red bikini and it doesn't fit me nicely so got this one it's one of the ones with the underwire so like you can't actually bend it i love this i have tried it on and i prefer it with straps like this i just think it looks a lot more flattering um the bottoms are a bit annoying though with this like i feel like if the bottoms were a little bit more strappy it would have like looked nicer together do you know what i mean like a little bit more primark thong vibe <laughs> i'm just gonna roll them anyway it's gonna be fine and then the last one that i picked up i feel like it's my favorite one because it's like a little bit different to like what you normally see but it's the same bikini as before but it's just like really nice rich like blue leopard print one and it has like these gold chains here which again i like more when they're like straps over you know at the front you know what i mean and then the bottoms are a bit different on these ones as well like these are literally my favorite things ever bottoms look like this and then these bits tie around your waist and you can like tie them twice and then they have the gold detailing and two gold chains literally just sit like this and just hang down on your legs i just i love it because i feel like it's a little different honestly now looking at it i feel like i should have got it in a different color as well but I tried to like not get the same bikini twice. I got two little body chains as well. I did open one so I could show you. This is like so nice as well. I do have to put it on the tightest ones, but it fits me right on the like tightest one. So I'm sure if you're anything above a 25 waist, you'll be sound with these. So yes, you guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you did enjoy it. If you did, please leave a like on this video down below and subscribe if you are new as it would mean the absolute world to me. And yes, I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys. Bye.